Alright, it is Friday morning. Uh, I just pulled all the eBay stuff off my phone. All the eBay orders, about 300 bucks worth of stuff here. Um, this one's over 50 bucks alone. Doesn't look like much, but uh, let me get this. Uh, I gotta print out everything and then package it all up now. There we go, 44 items it was. All right, six, six thirty-two, and all the eBay packages are ready to go. Now I just have to. I think there was four Bricklink orders I need to pack up. I'm not sure if I'll get them all out today, but definitely on Saturday I'll get the rest. If not, but we'll just get a half an hour before I start my other job, so gotta get moving. Oh yeah, I can do this. Nine, eight, eleven, three. Had one, one all day before that, and these came in after 10 p.m. So. I can definitely do that. I guess I forgot to check Brick Owl. There's three on there too. Uh, definitely get the first two. I don't know about the 21 lot one. I probably run out of time, or I might, I might make it work. We'll see. All right, I have uh, the four Bricklink orders are done. Uh, three more Brick Owl. I'll get, I'll get two for sure, but I should, I might work a little overtime to get the last one. All right, it's 7 a.m. Just packed this last Bricklink order up, so I got to get to my desk and get going and then I'll uh, print the labels. I can do that stuff from my desk and then package this up in a moment. All right, it is um, almost lunchtime, just I guess 10 a.m. Uh, and I just got done editing both the new vlogs for the last seven days of footage. So just saving this one for, I guess, rendering it. Yeah, rendering media. And then I have to upload it to YouTube, both of them. Yeah, remember when I said I could get Mondays off of work? Um, they just sent an email saying that we could potentially have up to 12, between 1 and 12 weeks off straight this summer. So I have applied for 12 weeks off. I'm hoping I get it. Alright, I just parted out this thing. Uh, I did not add these parts or these parts yet. These actually already added to Bricklink. It's nice when somebody adds the initial, they put the stickers on, take a photo of this. It's already there. So, you know, older sets are not even there yet, so, um, but it's really good. Uh, it's like seven bucks for the pieces. I mean, it's got some cool things like a bat and controller. Um, and then this printed thing right there. And that's, yeah, that's not included in these two, it comes with two minifigs. I mean, that's a really good set uh, with some really cool pieces. Um, I mean, not that many pieces, but... If this was seven bucks, I might buy a ton of them to part them out for the minifigs. Um, there's some nice minifigs there. All right, now I'm getting to the stuff I got sent to me. I'm a fan of the channel here. And I am going to add all this to my Bricklink store, or keep some, I'm gonna actually keep some of the pieces. Like I need that. I think I'm waiting for this for the minifigure I have for Captain Jack Tricor. Um, Tricorn, whatever, and uh, it's great stuff in here. Look at this, guys. Approved and entered starting 6:15 due to training. To be scheduled, you have Monday 6:08 off. So I applied to take the next 12 weeks off of work, and they have approved it. This is amazing. Oh, I just, I got a couple extra guys. Uh, I don't need this many. I think I need, I don't, I actually didn't need any of those. I think I got uh, three more extra of the big ones. My store has some, but I decided to order. And I got three more extra of the 33 size. There's the total. Wow. And it's got to get wood. Probably a piece of plywood for the backs. <laughs> It's gonna be worth it. I am just blown away at the value some of this stuff has that I that I received. Like just those uh, heads, four heads, three hairs, and four legs. We have here. If I go back, uh, this is the minifig I think it came on that they took the torso and they used it, which is I don't. It's not here, so that is a good one. That's the one for the Cloud City Luke Skywalker, which I currently out of, which I need. <laughs> Uh, but that is just, I mean, I'm just, just over and over, I'm going through these, and, whoops, there's one more. 
There's, some, there's another two hairs and a leg I better put in there, so. So yes, greatness. Well, my work day is over. Um, I got through most of it. Uh, that was random. Looks like there's just a couple of things here I did not get to besides all the ones that uh, these will go fast. Oh, I guess there's more than I realized. These, these are all different and then there's capes. Uh, and then there's nindroids. I guess there's more than all of these I have to do still. So we'll get there. Do them tomorrow on Saturday morning. So I've decided no part outs this weekend because of the expansion I'm going to do. I'm going to have to like, switch some numbers up on my wall. So uh, I don't want to fill up any more drawers right now because I might have to move some parts around. I don't, it's kind of time consuming to do it. I don't want to do it, but we're going to have start it here, two rows here, and then it's going to go in. There'll be a little wall here. And then it will go, uh, I think it's going to go five, five rows until about here. And then we're going to have two rows angled meeting here. So it's going to definitely uh, dwarf this amount, uh, this size of the wall by probably about two more, two more rows, maybe three more than this one has in the end. Not exactly sure, uh, how it's going to go, uh, but it's going to be great great for the store and all my backlog all right we're gonna do a quick lot check at the end of friday looking good oh, something just sold traffic cop series 2 on ebay uh here's our orders if it ever shows up looking good and then on ebay we have 1212 items for sale how many do we sell i have a big sale on right now 18 Okay, it looks like I won something. Let's see if we can uh, pull that up. Looks like I was the only one to bid on it. Don't know if it's anything good here. Oh yes, the Inquisitor. Skylar, Ninja Turtles. Pretty good, not great, but that guy alone will fetch about 20 bucks, I bet. Uh, I think I have his uh, his hilt for his uh, dual lightsaber. That's nice. All right, we have our mail from Friday. Total of seven items. So they're all on eBay. <laughs> Not all of them, but um, let's see. So we got some capes. Just looking at the prices I'm looking at. So this one here was $16 free shipping. This one ended up being 16 total. And this one was uh, 64 So here's a $64 purchase right here. It's a big bag. Highway Rescue Tonka. Um, there's some yeah, non-Lego things. There's a cow in there. Very good. Uh, there was, I'm not sure why I got this. It's just supposed to be an auction that I was at. Just threw a number up there. Um, obviously, it's, it's about a pound, a little more, but there was definitely some things in there. It's a like Doc Octopus older one. Um, but there's that. Yeah, it had a lot of random pieces in there as well. And then this one, oh boy, both of these other two were 16 bucks. random not very much stuff in here there but they're a good price that many thing actually she sells on Bricklink for about four dollars three to four or something I sell her every time I put her in there I never put her on eBay for some reason because oh yes I need one of these Ooh, a regular blue coffin I don't know if I've ever had one of those there's there's something in there find out with me Ooh, the studio's mummy I saw his headgear was in there so that alone, this right here, this guy alone, pretty much almost pays for this. Ooh, that's a cool coffin. I don't think I've ever had the gray one either. Some good stuff in here for the price. Certainly good. So the mummy, her, this, and that airport lady pay, definitely paid for it. Um, and then here's another one. It's got a hole in it. 
Whose head is that? Maybe General Hux. Is that, or is that Captain Boomerang? Is that his right head and torso? I don't even know. Not sure. Um, what did I buy this? I had some superhero stuff. It was a really good deal. Ooh, that's a good looking head. Right there. Katana, is that her name? I don't know. So there's that. And I got some capes off from eBay. They're from Canada, the brick business. Um, all new capes. I got. I went there because of these. These were... They're very hard to find on uh, Bricklink. Even at a good price. These are like a $1.40 each or something. Pretty good deal. And then I came to this. This is Bricklink. Because I had a good quantity of these. I was completely out. And they had some things for the books. You know, I like the Nexo books. I have a... Uh, Monopoly on those on eBay. And then uh, this was from Sheepdees, I think. We never have a card in here, I always forget. Um, all stuff on my wanted list. And then this is order 114 or 115. I should get that straight. And it came in some nice packaging. And that's it. Trying to figure out a spot for a used parts sorting station. <laughs> I moved those out of the way. I don't think anywhere over here really works. This huge table might not work how I want it. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think I might put get a six foot table here. Hmm, still debating how to figure it out. All right, Saturday morning. On eBay, 47 items to ship. Bricklink has five, and Brick Owl has four. The winner is Bricklink. All right, Saturday's mail. This one came from Deutschland. It's a very good, good Bricklink order. Lots of good stuff that I needed. I've been waiting for. Um, actually, I bought a bunch of complete Chimith things. I think there's three different ones. Yeah. New figures, Moro, Moro heads. Oh, there's so much. A lot of this stuff I ended up putting back on my wanted list by the time I was waiting. If I found out I still needed it, so <clears throat> a lot of stuff I already have. I don't need it, even need it anymore. And they gave you the free gummies. That's my daughter's gonna like that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, these are all new. I think new helmets for Star Wars. Yeah, some great. Great stuff. I paid for it though. <laughs> I think this is like a twenty some dollar shipping, maybe thirty. I don't I don't know. Glad it's here. Uh from Get Some Bricks. Just a small brickling order. I think I came here for the arms. We needed white arms. <clears throat> Most likely. I'm guessing. Because it's the two different I don't rarely buy arms unless I actually need them. I'll just start, I'll buy whoever has the cheapest right at that point. So <clears throat> and then this is eBay. I think I paid like a dollar or fifty each minifig. They're not all complete though. Um, she, you know, they're missing some accessories. He's missing his map. Um, there's some things missing on most of them. But either way, they're good part out for a dollar fifty each. You can't go wrong there. So that is the Saturday mail. All right, so we're at Saturday at about two o'clock. I just uh, I left the basement about nine thirty after I got everything shipped out, and then. I'm not parting out like I said before. We are going to be just processing all of these minifigs that I never got to this week. <laughs> and uh, parting some out to uh, Bricklink. And uh, getting the rest ready for eBay. So I'll do that and that'll be it for Saturday. I think, well, I had one Bricklink order that I didn't pack up. So it was like 60 some lots. And I would not have gotten them all out on time for the mail, most likely. Or I could have. I might have, but I was just done. <laughs> like I said, I don't say I ship out on Saturday, but most times I do. Uh, but that will be getting that out on Monday, so that Monday a day is a day off. I work four more days until I have 12 weeks off. It's awesome. And the kids were kept asking me to uh, job for jobs, and a lot of times when I ask them to sort things, they just kind of leave a mess for me in the end. Um, so I set this up for, this is temporary, I can move this, move it all around. Um, thought they could watch some educational TV. 
at times that they want. Um, but this is uh, I w <clears throat> so the thing is that once a week I will ch upload whatever they sorted, and then they will get ten percent of whatever uh, the prices of that of everything that is uploaded. So something like that. Um, let's try it out. We'll see how much they get. We're gonna try the table a little different. I think it's heavy. It's an old slate pool table. <laughs> Um, not sure if I'll keep it this way. I might actually move it closer into this area potentially. So I want to block off the walkway. I guess I can go around if I move it this way more. And then over to our pantry area. But uh, we'll just do it there for now. All right, it is Saturday. Just uploading those parts over there. And FedEx came bearing gifts, kind of. So, um, this is $49.99, Lego Shop at Home, I paid full price, and I got this, and I got some of the Ninjago ones as well that are on back order right now, it's like just over $85, bucks. so I get this, um, I figure, uh, you know, it's $50, bucks, but if I can get $10 bucks back for that, it's like I pay $40 for this, you know, makes sense, because I got three at Walmart, and 220 some lots, I think it is. I didn't want to just part out three, so I got six more. This is another order I placed, just these two, at a hundred bucks. Got one of these. This is in the box, and this box is a little crushed. Whatever. Um, I'm not sure how the sticker sheet to that fell out. <laughs> oh, it's still slide it in the side. Maybe it must have came out the side. I don't know. But these are on the chopping block pretty quick here in the next few weeks. I don't anticipate getting any more. Um, and I really, normally I don't part out sets that I that are pretty new, so on the shelves potentially. I don't anticipate getting any more. So, and I like, I would, I really want to part this out for some reason. <laughs> um, I don't think I've ever did any head inside. I don't think I did. I've never parted out one yet. So, I see other people parting them out, and it looks fun. And the minifigs are fun. <clears throat> so I'm definitely going to wait on the school to the expansion. Well, actually, this will be after the expansion's done as well. But the school will come shortly after that. So we'll get those in there. All right, that's it for Saturday. Didn't quite make it through everything. Uh, I got uh, the Super Dog and Superman and Hawk Girl done. Did not get these other two done. But everything else I got done. I added some good stuff, so we will see you on Monday morning for got a date with that cart. Well, I might as well give a quick uh, part and lot number here this Saturday night. So I won't be adding anything until Monday after lunch, probably after I get everything shipped out. I'm not sure. Right now it's pretty light for Bricklink. About 120 lots I have to pull for between Bricklink and Brickall, which shouldn't take me much more than an hour. So right now, we'll see what happens on Sunday. I have $100 worth of wood. I think I got a little too much, but I'll have extra for later. June 7th, clearance check. Okay, it is Monday, 5.30, 6. I've been probably up for about 15 minutes. Um, on eBay, we have 76 items to ship. <laughs> on Bricklink, there is, uh, there's 19. And then on Brick Owl, there's six. <laughs> um, so my first step is to print everything out except the shipping labels for Bricklink and Brick Owl. Um, so I do eBay first, and then I get moving. And then uh, after that, I rebuild eBay today. See how much the shipping's gonna cost. And then um, I start building my new wall. So here's the 5:37 a.m. me. <laughs> Let's get to work. So here's what I got the shipping to uh, after I made the right. It, for some reason, it comes up all as priority every time I gotta switch it. I think it's because I have it just as expedited shipping in my listings. Um, I don't know, but I have 41 of the orders, I think there's 47 total, that actually had to pay the shipping of 
so that's not a bad turnover um, not paying too much out in shipping so I like that this is pretty cool about Brick Owl um, on my orders page it's saying how many items I have 90 lots to, to pull out of 253 total items it tells me how much the total was that I received plus 21 shipping so that's pretty cool I like that so now that I have everything printed except for my shipping labels for Bricklink and Brick Owl that is a job in itself <laughs> um, especially with that many uh, labels I have to print um, so now I'm going to remove my eBay store from the shelves and those two boxes and those four uh, put them on the table and start pulling them all right I have all the items pulled <laughs> and the next step is to 46 times wrap them in bubble wrap and then slap the labels on the envelopes and match them up and then move on to Bricklink and Brick Owl there it is folks 46 packages on eBay 70 some total uh, items 7 15 a.m. so now I'm gonna have a little quick breakfast let the chickens out and get on to this monster <laughs> I love it good morning come on out <laughs> this is rhubarb it's gigantic <laughs> going to seed. We just made a whole bunch of uh, rhubarb butter and stra rhubarb strawberry jam will be coming shortly once the strawberries are here. Good morning. Good girl. Want to go outside? Where's your ball? Where's your ball? Ball? All right, here it is. These are all the Bricklink orders on this side, and then the Brick Owl on this side. So I'm going to start with the Brick Owl. Feel that accomplishment of getting these six orders done, and then moving on to the next uh, uh, task here. I'm not sure the uh, many lots. I know there's 90 lots here. <clears throat> I know there's three orders with over 50 lots, around 50 to 60 on some uh, here. So I would imagine there's about 400 lots in here at least. So if, let's say I estimate 500 lots. I got to pull. And let's see the time frame here we got going on. Just turned 740. So I shouldn't need any more breaks. Uh, so it depends on how long it takes, obviously, but let's get going. First brick owl, brick owl order pulled. I had to start up my tablet. And there it is. Second brick, or brick, <laughs> brick owl order. We gotta get that straight. It's kind of small, but... It's actually very nice. All right, the third brick link or brick <laughs> brick owl order is now packed up. Pretty much all Technic stuff, even the big Technic helmets uh, for those guys. I think it's everything is Technic. I don't see any common things common bricks. So uh, I've had questions on like uh, videos about brick owl. As people are thinking of doing it. It is an extra step to sync things. Definitely uh, every. During the day, I'll like take stuff out of here to complete minifigs. If I don't update that daily, Brick Owl will say I still have it, and Bricklink doesn't. So I have to make sure that I do that. So um, it's just something you got to keep in mind if you're taking inventory in and out of Bricklink. The way I do it, I just at the end of my workday, you know, for for a few hours, things are going to show I have more in Brick Owl and that could potentially sell. Um, but if it does, I still have those parts. In, in my possession, I just probably recreated a minifig and put it for sale on eBay. I can take it down from eBay, take the part, because um, I kind of keep track of that until I'm done working for the day. But um, yeah, I've had no no problems at all. Um, I don't know how many, it's like 30 some orders I've had now on Brick Owl, and everything looks good. I mean, obviously, it would show up later when other parts. Uh, from say someone they sold on Brick Owl but didn't get taken off of Bricklink. I've, I've, you get an email every time a sale comes through from Brick Packer that says we've taken these lots from Bricklink or we've taken them for Brick Owl. It depends on where the sale took place on. It'll take the parts off of the other site. So that is something uh, just a little more work, but it's definitely worth it in my opinion. Um, so that's that that question answered, I guess. If, if you have more questions on it, let me know. All right, uh, Brick Owl is done. I had one that came in while I was packing up, so this one is a minifig BB-8, so 
90 lots, 91, including that one. That was fast. Here's the biggest order of the weekend. It's going to the United Kingdom. Not, okay, the biggest dollar amount order, I should say. Nah, it took me five minutes to pack that. Here's a time check, Monday morning. Um, so I've, I've done four BrickLink orders so far. 65 lots, 21 lots, 33 lots, and 69 lots. And then we go up, 32 is the highest left. So we have broken through the slow part. You only have, yeah, one, two, was it three orders that are more than 20 lots, four. There we go. So this should, see how long it takes us to do the last. Four, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15 orders. And so here's my first order, my small order. Now it's a rarity. I, every lot is in a different bag. This is new. This is used. This is new. This is used. I mean, some people aren't going to care if newer used are together, but I just separate them. All right, 10.50. Here we go. Um, everything is packed up. I just have to print out the labels and add the tracking to the order pages and slap the labels on envelopes and then take it to the post office with the eBay stuff that's over there. It's not too bad. I'm not sure what time I started again. Was it nine? Two hours? I did take about a 10 minute break, coffee break there. So yeah, it's fun. All right, so here's what it's gonna cost me to ship out these 25 orders, I already shipped out one to the UK um, before, but it doesn't bring it up in this multi-shipping situation, so we'll just go off of this. So these 25 orders, I have to pay 75 to ship, and I received this much for shipping. So uh, if you look at this, what I showed you, the other number, this is what, nine extra dollars I pay? I pay them out of my pocket nine dollars to send out 25 orders. I do get that question about is the free shipping worth it to you it definitely brings a ton of orders I mean there's no doubt about it people are adding up to twenty dollars just to get the free shipping they might have only wanted a couple of items that they whoa twenty bucks I'm gonna throw all this other stuff in there I don't know I don't hear those accounts but it is uh, it definitely is worth it and you get people that love your store who doesn't like free shipping right well this is a tedious task um, you gotta do two clicks on each one. You gotta unclick stock room and then click delete. All these items that sold on Brick Owl, that when they take them off of BrickLink, they, I guess Brick Packer, that's the only option that they have to put it in stock room. They just change it instead of deleting it. I don't know if that's some system limitation that they can't just delete off of BrickLink, I would imagine. I don't know. But it seems like, um, Bricks, brick Packer can delete off a of Brick Owl because you don't have to do this on Brick Owl, so I don't really get that. Anyway, I'm at the bottom now. Finally, took me a while. <laughs> Two clicks on each 87 items. Get them out of my inventory. I, don't, I never have anything in stock room. Even if I lose parts in the wall, I just write it down and hopefully I find it at some point. <laughs> um, but I just never have stock room stuff. All right, our first step in the expansion here is uh, yeah, clearing this off and moving it to right over there next to that bubble wrap. I think we're going to try it there. All right, this was not my original plan, specifically to be up on this uh, build up here, but it barely fit. There's like maybe a quarter inch <laughs> on each side that one might be even less so it's up there I don't hope it doesn't fall as long as there's enough weight on it it shouldn't move um, I have everything on there everything moved we got some extra space up top for that I, I kind of rearranged the used boxes here because this is the stuff that I get and I process the minifig stuff I don't need it on that all the stuff next to me like these two these can be somewhere else but for now, that's what I did. And then there's the new shoe boxes and then some more used part, uh, sets. Those are more, more stuff I got in the mail. I have to go through. It makes it really look like there's a lot, again, because there is. Oh, and then there's, there's today's mail. 
this one six hundred dollar package that I bought on a couple videos back <laughs> from Canada. It's, it's, it's uh, it took longer to arrive than expected, but it's here. I'll open that later in the video, probably tomorrow. So we are heading out to Costco in about two hours, and I have to re do the re the rest of the eBay cards. My son did a bunch of them. Well, actually, I don't have very many. But he has some he didn't do still, so I'm gonna go do his because he was slacking a little. No, just kidding. Board number one in place. Well, actually, not really. It is in place. It was here. So I took that off of there for a reason that will be seen in this in this expansion. I don't know about this video. <laughs> um, I got two more boards to put in. I need two to go. One there and one there for this side. And then um, got to build the bottom. And then, uh, yeah, we'll see where we go from there. But I think I'm done building for today. My The drill was not charged up. <laughs> it's charging now. Okay, I lied. Uh, I'm, I just kept on going. Um, got these two supports up and I'm going to cut the piece of plywood and then I'm gonna have two uh, two by four running to there one there and one along the back so I can put this there all right so I didn't think I was gonna do much today but we did very well uh, the only thing left for this spot is to put on the plywood right there and then I'll put one sideways here and then one, I'm gonna need a little bit higher there gonna enclose this whole staircase basically uh, right to the bowl um, the cut around some things obviously just like I did up there um, to make it work so very happy with that progress and I have the stuff I think I'm gonna extend three more to here I, I don't see why not I mean if this is gonna be a full-time venture um, why not do it now because I'm gonna definitely be renumbering these or I might just be moving the whole thing over to wherever I start. Uh, I don't want anything on this side of it though, I don't think. Um, probably not. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Thank you.